Jason Zimmerman's here today to talk to Emory men's basketball coach. Uh, the season's flown by. Coming up Saturday, last regular season game of the year at Rochester. Yeah, it's amazing how fast uh, the 14 games in the league go. Well, well, sometimes it goes fast, right? Sometimes you think it's you're, you're slogging along here, but uh, but it, it does go fast, and it's, it's uh, the the way you guys improve throughout the year, those through those 14 games and the the travel. That you that you go on, it's a, it's a great journey that you get to go on every year, and we're looking forward to ending it up here at Rochester. Now you open the uh, conference portion of the schedule against Rochester, and it's been you know 13 games since you played them. But what have you seen from them uh, in looking at this week's film compared to your first game? Yeah, you know they're a lot more experienced. Uh, well, obviously because they've had 13 games together, uh, so they're, they're a pretty young and, and, and inexperienced group. They lost a lot of seniors from last year when they came into the UAA, so. They've gone through 13 UAA games together. They kind of know uh, each other better and, and know their roles a little bit better than they, than they have uh, 13 games ago. And Luke does a really good job of putting them in positions to be successful. And, uh, and it, puts, it puts a defense and offense in, in uh, tough situations where you have to execute and, and communicate with each other uh, to guard them for sure. I know, obviously, a game, a uh, potential for uh, for you guys to co-tie for the championship. Your game behind now, in in preparation, is that in the back of your mind, or is it, is it more just winning the game and, and just yeah. getting some a uh, positive momentum into the? Uh, yeah, the following I think week? you just want to just play better, right? You mm -hmm. just continue to get better, play better. I know it's coach speak, but it's true. Mm -hmm. You just want to continue to play better, do what you can do. The only thing that we can do uh, as the Emory basketball team is try to win the game on Saturday, right? And, mm -hmm. Uh, yeah, we, there's, uh, we're still in contention, I guess, uh, mm -hmm. but so we have to get some help from people. But So the only thing that we, we just try to control, we can control, and that's getting ready to play Rochester on Saturday, staying healthy, staying emotionally healthy, physically healthy, uh, to get ready to go play on, on Saturday, and that's what we'll do. And we'll play this game just like we have the, the other 13, like tr try to get a little bit better, see what we can do to win the game. Uh, coming off a split last weekend, uh, when at Carnegie came up short against Case, uh, just kind of take us back through that. Yeah, you know, both games, uh, both games were great games. Uh, you know, the Carnegie game, I thought we really executed and, and scored offensively when we had to. Uh, you know, we, we couldn't stop them for a stretch there, and, and offensively we, we executed really well and finished plays around the rim. Then the last four minutes or so, we, we were in great late game situations and late game and closing out the game uh, late. And part of that was on, on, on our staff, on, on me, because we, we kind of tried to uh, we quit attacking a little bit uh, with, with some of the things we did. And so it just slowed the game down a little bit for us. And we were in a pretty good rhythm before that. Uh, so we talked about that a little bit at the case game. And then uh, the case game, we obviously didn't guard like we wanted, like we need to guard to win a game and on the road in the league. And uh, they had a couple guys have great games, but it's on us too. Uh, we have to be able to stop to stop them and understand what we have to do to stop them, execute better, communicate better. And I, and I think we've got better at that this week, and we will. And then offensively too, you can't hit the panic button, right? Mm -hmm. uh, when things aren't going great, you got to stay with what we do. And, uh, you know, I thought a couple times, uh, for as experienced as we are, I thought a couple times we kind of breathing fast and, and hit the panic button a little bit uh, too soon. And uh, but we, we hung in there, we fought, and we got back to, I think it was a one-point game with 44 seconds left, we needed to get a stop, and we couldn't do it, and we couldn't make a basket down the stretch. So uh, it, it's great preparation for us for this week, and it's going to be great preparation for us for the postseason, and we're looking forward to getting better. All right, Coach, thanks very much for your time. Let's get ready for the trip. Uh, good luck this weekend, and we'll see you uh, next week. Thanks, John.